Aw, oh, man. Am I prepared or what? You better freaking believe it. <laughs> How's it going, everybody? Oh, we gotta turn the music on. There we go. There we go. Everyone loves a surprise stream on a Friday. That's right. Everyone without a life who has no friends to hang out with, including myself. Self-burn. Woo. <laughs> <laughs> Nate! Bo Rich, man, another Bo, right on! Spells his name differently than me, that's alright though. Pino! What's up? Cades! Outdoor Adventures, Tyler! Avery Faustad! That's how I'm pronouncing that. <laughs> Marcus Fowl, Father Timothy Descato is in the house. Domingo! Acid! Unfazed! Vito! Vito! Koi Foil, Jonathan Kacharski, Rankin Wiggins. How much money do you need to go to the Everglades? Enough, man. You need enough. I don't know. They they literally tell you the prices. What are you asking me for? You you think I'm gonna sell you some sort of care package or something like that? What's up, unfazed? Hey, 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 XD Firewolf Brent Lee's here. Today we're gonna be doing a little bit of fishing at Emerald Lake. As uh as foretold, feel free to join in, I guess, if you're a uh, low enough level for Emerald Lake and you want to join in <laughs> for some reason. Oh, golly. I think I'm actually at the point where I'm ready to travel, change days, I guess. So, let's see here. I think, I think that's about where I, I... I caught my full keep net. Yep, that's exactly what happened. Right on. Well, we will switch to nighttime here, and then we'll switch to this time here. Though, so I'll be honest, I'll be honest. 
part of me just wants to skip this entire day. Mmm, decisions, decisions. Because I believe, even though it's going to cost me some moolah, this is the best, this is the better day to be fishing on. So let's, let's go to that. And we got a marker buoy and an advertisement. Yeah, boys. Top notch. Commercial fishing might be shut down early this year. Why is that? I haven't heard this news. Gage Picard is here. Named after one of my favorite captains. Right on. Freug. Geocaching. Just started playing Fishing Planet again after a while. Right on. Pierre is here. Hello, Pierre. This is my first stream I've watched. Reap Duncan. Glad to have you, man. Glad to have you. We're going to throw this out here. Throw this out here. Get get one of them, those uh, fishy boys on the on the on another fishy boy, the small minnow. <laughs> oh golly. Bo Richmond, hi. Yeah, we've already said hi, Bo. Golly, say something else. We're past the introductions now. We're onto the conversations. Get with it. Get with the train. John Pranger, hello. Bo, I've level twenty three. What level till should you farm the Everglades? Man, whenever you feel confident in going through the Everglades. Um, I'm probably not going to go to the Everglades until I have like a maybe 12 to 14 pound rod and reel combo. Um, and a good amount of uh, room in the keep net. Because you, you'll think that a lot of the bass that you catch will be between 6 and 10 pounds. Around there anyway. So be prepared to... Uh, Oh, wrong rod. Be prepared to uh, to catch easily 60, 60 pounds plus, 60, 80, 100 even pounds plus of fish. So just get as much as you can, man. Cool cats here. Good deal. Did you pay any real money for your boat? Uh, I, this isn't even my boat. This is a rentable boat. Um, so it's not even, I didn't, I didn't even buy this boat. I have no boats on this account. What's up, Pierre says. What's up, Pierre? Too low. Turn for pretty much all rivers up here. Lots of reds, but people are catching kings as well, so we might get shut down. Ooh, interesting. Okay. Interesting. Oh, we got one on the on the bottom run. Right. You're at Emerald right now, actually. We're right on, Noah. Just finally got that narrow spoon to sink down to the bottom, and then we caught one on the uh, on the small minnow. So that's cool. Oh, I bet he does, Froig. I bet he does. Hey, let me know if your refrigerator's running, okay, Froig? Last week I went to Northern and caught my personal best, 3.5. Right on, man. That's awesome. Did you post a picture in the uh, in the Inner Life Pictures channel? Get in here, you walleye. Yo, yo, freaking walleye. There we go. There we go. Over halfway leveled up to go to the next next level there. We're cruising, guys. Guys, gals, everything. Making our way. Henry Grobelard's here. How's it going, Henry? All right, let's get this puppy off the bottom here. We got walleyes to catch. A little bit of stop and go action. Little bit of stop and go action. See if that tickles their fancy. Are we gonna try Way of the Hunter? You better believe it, man. If a hunting or fishing game comes out, you better believe. Gonna be playing some uh some of it on the BZ Hub. Are we gonna do a beginner series on the angler? Uh I mean yeah, probably. Doing our like playthrough of the game, yeah, for sure. Oh boy, we got two on right now. We gonna get it? I think we are. Let's go get this guy. Barbless Master as well, top notch. Got a bait coin for that. This guy was running, took us out to 140. New fan. This is the same fan I've had the whole time. I'm just super hot in here. <laughs> well, are you the new fam? Charming, charming. Is this a different account? It is a different account. Yeah, this is our free-to-play account. 
uh, that we've been putting out the uh, Series 2 Beginner Series 2 Beginner Series videos on. 1.909. It's, uh, it's interesting with the smaller walleye because they actually put it up closer to your face to seem larger. Um, so, so the smaller walleye almost seem bigger than the larger walleye. Just because they like put it up closer to your face and they seem bigger in the in the frame. We've got two on the um, two on the bottom rod so far. One on the uh, narrow spoon. Keep it going, keep it going. While I'm not working, hey, right on, Ralpatine. It's a cool name too. I dig it. Is it possible to reset your account? No. You get one shot. You get one shot, don't mess it up. Though if you do mess it up, you can always just log into the game every day and it gives you free money every day. So uh, if you're really, ooh, we got another fish on that other rod. Got another fish on this rod. Um, if you are running out of money, I mean, you get, what is it? 200, 300, 400, 500 bucks every day or something like that. It goes on a, on a loop pattern or whatever. Are you going to play the new fishing game? Yes. Call the, call the angler. You better believe it. We're excited for it. People are already saying that we are going to be the master of, uh, of call of the angler. Um, I say people because I don't know anyone specifically, but they're, they're definitely saying it. Don't you? And if anyone asks, anyone outside of this live stream conversation, you let them know that people are talking. BZ Hub is going to be the master, the, the master of this game, you know? Uh, one of those sort of like Flinter Who, uh, BZ Hub is who you should watch for the angler, you know? One of those, one of those sort of situations. <laughs> oh God. Go to Amron, never catch walleye. Try what they like to eat, but I always end up catching $400 worth of pickerel and pike. That just sounds like you're fishing on the wrong days, my friend. Are you fishing on the right days, fallow father, huh? Daddy. How are you? I'm doing quite well. How are you? What's the best bait for tarpon? I always caught a lot of them on large minnows. But feel free to, to mess around. Sardines, maybe? Scaled sardines, I think, and catch them on. Are you in a private room? We are in a semi-private room. We're in a friends-only room. So, any friends of uh, this account can join in. Whoa. Yearns on the hunt. And we're hooked up, boys. Noah! Thank you for the sub. I haven't fished with live bait in like eight years. What are you doing? Another one, another one. I think we're like two fish away from leveling up right now. Two fish away from leveling up right now. Better to grind at Mongolia or Weeping Willows? I don't know, dude. Do whatever sounds fun. <laughs> um, I haven't tested it, so I really don't know. Oh, I don't even have the big light on it. It's still hot in here. It was uh, it was 101 in Kansas today. What was it like for everyone else? Did it get hotter than that in your uh, neck of the woods? Oh, we're hooked up and we didn't even didn't even reel it in that much. Goodness gracious! When are you fishing at the Everglades? Um, whenever we get to a high enough level to go fish at the Everglades, and uh, and I get a 14 pound rod and reel. Just found out I get to go pike fishing on Lake of the Woods with my grandpa in like five days. What? Dude, that's sick. Lake of the Woods is one of those places I definitely want to go fishing at. Got a big muskie on my bucket list. Bucket list fish, man. Easy Hub, the legend of fish. The legend of fishing planet is, is likely to become a legend in the angler. That's what everyone's saying. <laughs> Shane Ann, how's it going? Tune then. Hope they have walleye on the angler. Also, hope they put saltwater maps on the game. Dude, I, I bet you. I bet you they will do something. I bet they're thinking about it. They are trying to figure out how to do it. 
on incoming humps and I use shiners for them, but Pickerel just go crazy over me. Well, goodness gracious. Well, I mean, this day, we've I've been fishing on this day almost solely. Father Gaming, good deal. Hey, thanks for this sub. Uh, this day seems to be doing really well. We're unfortunately going to have two of these uh, double hump days, and I, I haven't fished those yet, but... Brentley Thompson with the sub as well. Nice. Forget to like if you... Yeah, don't forget to like if you're watching. Caught out. Gotta fish deep in real life. Yeah. Gotta fish deep. With that crankbait or something. What is your favorite fish in this game? Ooh. I, I don't know. I like, uh... I think I'm a pretty big fan of the tarpon. I just like how they go after topwater lures and they're just giant fish. <clears throat> so that's probably that's probably probably one of my favorites. Though I bet when I have more time to do some tiger fish fishing, I'll uh, I'll enjoy that as well. 103 in Oklahoma. Nice. Another hot one. Oi! Racing, I'm in a close battle for the uh, console practicing start. Hey, no big deal, Carson Peters. You you keep up keep up with it. 80 in Washington. Is that a WA Washington? Oh, putting up a bit of a fight here. 90 today. Humidity was 90%, so it felt like 105. <laughs> Humidity, eh? Now, this guy's putting up a little bit of a fight here. You think we might have our first trophy on? We'll just have to see. Do you have any channels or anything to teach you how to use a fly rod? No, I don't. And I'm honestly not like a master fly rod user either, but I know just enough to get by. Um, but I'm sure there's some really good fly uh, fly casting videos and all that sort of stuff out there. It's one of those uh, specific uh, types of angling that uh, have been around for a long time and people have made a lot of videos about it. One nineteen in the steel plant. Goodness gracious! I think you. I think this guy's a trophy, dude. I think I might avoid that other rod for right now if we can. I don't want to lose this guy. We can get him in though. He's like right in the mid thirties. Dare I? Dare I? Reel in all that slack. There we go. Got it. At least we got all that slack reeled in. There we go. And we got him in. Expert angling skills. Expert angling skills. It is a trophy walleye. That's what I like to see. And we leveled up. 500 bucks. Boys. Don't be hitting me up with this stuff. We got Falcon Lake. Oh, jeez. Falcon Lake, dare we go. Dare we go. Look at all the stuff we got. Oh, no, dude. I shouldn't have looked. I shouldn't have looked at all this stuff. I should have just reeled him in. Ah, uh, curiosity got the best of me. Killed the cat. 103 in the panhandle. Good night. Love your streams. Right on, Shane. Mr. Mammoth says howdy. Howdy. I'm doing all right. How do you do? Um, 82 in Connecticut. Say bass, please, for fun. Are we talking about guitars here? What are we talking about, Domingo? We're talking about basses here. How do you catch tarpon? You know we actually have a tarpon video. Uh, for Everglades. Civic Kids here. How's it going? It's going pretty well. We're uh, catching walleye. Uh, fly fishing is a whole new ball game, but it's a lot of fun. I, I really like it. Vicky says hi Level nine stuck at Lone Star catch any chunky boys yet. We just got a uh, five pounder. I think which isn't too bad 754 for you right now It's uh, seven. Yeah, same time for me Can you tell me why your line always breaks um, drags too high fishing for too large a fish um, they have teeth. There's a number of different things. 
So you're on an eight pound grouper. An eight pound grouper, my goodness. Never caught a grouper before. When I first started watching, I thought you had one million subs. I just, you know, I just put off that aura, you know? I put off that one million sub aura. Um, you know. I got big sub energy, I believe. Congo River is another way to make money. Oh, people always ask me, what's the best way to make money? Go to the Congo River and catch fish, man. Best way ever. Definitely. Definitely is. Haven't caught a stream for a while. Trophy Mall. Well, glad you made it. Just started watching you this morning. It's 7.54 p.m. Yeah, right on. Well, it's, it's not anymore. Past that. 24 in UK. I missed it. The chat's moving quick. Working on class right now. Drive taking my driver to six days. Wow, civic kid. Right on, man. That's awesome. Watching you for about three months, fishing says. Ooh, right on. You're in central time zone? I Surprisingly, you know? When people ask me where I live and I say Kansas, uh, you know, they're always surprised when that's in the central time zone. The middle state of the United States. Can you believe it? Caught a BB blue swimmer crab in real life. Whoa. Where, where are you at? We're at Everglades. Or, uh, Emerald, yeah. We're at Everglades. Can't you tell? With the swamp. No, we're at Emerald Lake Light right now. I think I was somewhere around 10,000. Understandable. Clips with the sub. Thank you. Don't catch all the big and save sub for me. Oh, okay. I'll try, but no promises. What's a uh, daddy? Right on. Thanks for the sub. You deserve more. Well, thank you. Appreciate it. It'll all catch up one day. We'll we'll get some. In real life, ah, you know, people say that. Uh, I'm yet to meet someone who enjoys fishing with me in real life, but uh, maybe someday. <laughs> oh well, thank you, kid. Thank you, kid. Civic kid. Made it. How's your day been? Daniel Jones has been going pretty well. How's your day been? Keeping that stop and go. Three stars. You can get like $5,000 for like one the fish. Uh, you can get way more than that. Some of the Nile perch were giving you 20, 20 plus thousand dollars per fish. <clears throat> get some good walleye. Gotta go now. Good luck. Thanks, Dragiat. We got the luck of the Dragiat. So I want to do a still a video on another level three map if you scold near the Netherlands. What? Ah, what are you saying? You want me to go to Genter News and Canal? A couple days before Halloween two years ago. Right on, Carson Peters. I love Halloween. It's like one of my favorite ho uh, holidays. Close, close behind Christmas. I don't know. I like them both. 83 yeah 80 oh 83 degrees i was about to say 83 yeah 80 sometimes i also just say 83 is tarpon a good money fish they're not a bad money fish um i don't believe i don't know they might be actually <laughs> i mean to be honest anything that doesn't give you a hundred dollars per pound is bad money fish talking like walleye bass uh Pike are even not like that great, uh, but they give you a lot of money still. Um, yeah. I guess pike are fairly close. What do you do to catch more tarpon? What would you do to catch more tarpon? Um, yo, I, I always like to use uh, poppers and stuff, but you can use like large minnows and whatnot to go after them as well. Have I caught any sauger yet? Don't believe so. Creeks of Colorado. Thanks for the sub. I didn't even know they had any sauger here. They do though. Well, golly gee. 
How about that? My goodness gracious, I never knew that there was such a large saga out here. I'm gonna have to get my hands on one of those. What is the drone upgrade? Well, you see, an upgrade to the fishing videos would be film taken by a drone flying over. So, hence, upgrade drone footage. $1,200 away, because the drone costs $1,200. So, if we raise the funds, then we get an upgrade to the videos, where we have nice drone footage. I have. I I don't understand the enjoyment of Kendall Gray. Every time I watch him, I get annoyed and I have to click away. And all of his thumbnails are so... He's just... He's... He, I don't know what to call him. I, uh, I don't know. He looks like a prison guy. He's got a buzz cut, and he always has a goofy look on his face. I don't know. I don't know what to think of it. Every time I see one of his thumbnails, I'm like, why would I click on that? He's just a goofy guy doing something goofy. But maybe that's what kids like. I'm just, maybe that's my problem. I'm not making enough goofy videos. I need to have more videos of me, like, in the thumbnail, like. And then people will click on it and be like, oh, now that's the content that we want. I don't know. Maybe I don't get it. I don't. I just don't get the uh, the excitement around him. Like he had a video out uh, that popped up and it said shooting every animal I see, and it had like a hundred and sixty thousand views. And I was like, literally, that's what everyone does. Why? Why did that get a hundred and sixty thousand views? I don't. I don't get it. Oh God. What's a good minimum setup for bass? Uh, I'd say fourteen pounds. Twelve to fourteen pounds. If you're doing 12, you gotta have max drag. 14 pounds is better. You have carp in Minnesota? Nice. You're like 30 to 50k? Right on, man. Glad to hear it. Do I remember you? Listen, I'm not even gonna answer these questions anymore. Because I, I, I don't understand. I explain this every time. You know? If there's one thing to remember about me... It's that I remember everyone. And if you can't remember that about me, you know, I, I don't know what to tell you. You know, there's not there's not a two-lane road here. You know, why would I remember something about you if you can't remember something about me? Um, but yeah, I remember everybody, obviously. Just, I got a memory of a lifetime. Young Northern Pike, that was a surprise. Not terrible. It's a pound for 88 bucks. Not horribly off. We got room for like one more walleye. And we get it. I think I'm gonna have to spend a bait coin to keep keep fishing with all of you. <laughs> I'm a kid and I don't agree. Okay. Well that's good. Maybe that's why my uh my 14 and younger uh crowd isn't very good. How long you play fishing planet? Uh, I've only been playing for, oh golly, about a half hour today. How long you been playing Fishing Planet? Come on, baby. There we go. There we go. Hooked up. Hooked up. What's the number one update you would give Fishing Planet? What's the number one update? Saltwater fishing map, of course. We all want to fish saltwater, don't they know? Don't they know? I, I tell you the reason why they probably don't have a saltwater map. I don't know if their uh, their engine is capable of uh, creating waves. You know, like ocean waves, how they kind of move. I think that's the reason why they've been staying away from uh, creating an ocean map. Because it wouldn't look very realistic. Just an idea. Could be completely off. Reel that one in a little bit. Is there such a thing for about carp fishing for kayak? You certainly can, man. Certainly could. I mean, a kayak, you have to remember, it's just kind of a, a different way to get around, right? 
Um, if you if you could uh, stand there with a, a bait rod in the water, you'd essentially be like doing the same thing from a kayak. So you could you could throw like hooks with bread on them from a kayak to carp. You could catch carp that way, uh, top water fishing or whatever they call. Um, or you could literally just throw out bait, you know, sort of like you see with the guys that have fished for um, uh, kayaks for uh, flathead catfish and whatnot. There we go. We can't keep them, but another 2.7 pound walleye. Now we need to switch days. Uh huh. It's gonna be an hour before we can switch time, so I think we're gonna have to uh, switch that. How much money are we gonna make here? Let's see. It's gonna cost me a thousand dollars to switch to the next day, so I'm kind of curious. Yeah, we still end up getting 2,600. Just do it. All right, we're gonna end up getting 1600 is what I wanted to say. Oh no, cost us even more, we only got 1100, that's okay. Are we gonna have any good days after this? Yeah, we got two good days in a row. And then we get, we skip one day and then we have a third good day. Nice, that's not too bad. This is my favorite spot to throw out uh, my small minnows for uh, for the walleye. I just I caught one trophy uh, walleye here, and ever since I just toss out there every time, and I always get something. Alicia Terry with the sub, thank you. What's your name? What's your name? My name's Bo. Well, frick you, Bo. <laughs> Oh, if anyone's seen that video, it's a funny video. What is up, Blake says? Uh, I'm playing a fishing game. What are you up to, Blake? Wanaka Wall. Hey, BZ. How's it going, Wanaka? When will you stream again? Monday. Have you heard of the Yukon Huskies? Oh, sounds somewhat familiar. Not 100% sure, though. Falstad is, is 21. Good deal, man. You have two dollars and your license expires in six minutes. Well, better go somewhere that doesn't require a license, that's for sure. They need to add blue sharks and fish. They need to add blue sharks, huh? Why do they need to be blue, huh? I uh, fished away for a long time. Recently started watching a beginning series and I have done so well. Unlocked Emerald and was level 8 this morning. As of now, level 16. Creeks of Colorado. Right on, man. That's awesome. Glad to hear it. I love when I love when a plan all comes together, you know? That's why I put out the videos to help people out, you know? When you started playing Fishing Planet, me, March 2022, I started playing so this account we started oh just a month ago or so right uh, but the other account that we play on we started in gaming month of 20 20 2020 or 2021 i can't remember now i think it was 2020. that's a good size trophy walleye good deal 428 dollars don't mind if i do Throw that back out there. Jesus Madrigal, 498. Thank you, Jesus. Appreciate it. Davin's here. How's it going? Whoa. Whoa. Getting the guns going off. Nick Atkins, hi. Corestic. Hi. It caught me by surprise. I've never seen that name before. Bull sharks, you meant. There are bull sharks in the game. You crazy? TV bass on small bass on spoon lure. Food chain. <laughs> well, cool. Cody Games, hi. What reel is on your feeder rod? Ooh, I'm not sure. I'll have to look. Huge pet crawfish. I named him Duke Nukem. Hey, thank you for the uh, for the donation, Jesus. Appreciate it, man. I didn't I didn't really uh, uh, show enough appreciation as you can see by my lovely uh, 
my lovely, uh, what do you call it, bar there that shows uh, my funding. <laughs> We're trying to save up for drone footage. So every little bit helps. I appreciate it. Fishing only with float rods. I reach level 19 with it. Small minnows baits too fast with two rod stand, one rod in hand baits go very fast. Okay. Right on, Zakashi. That's interesting. I've never heard of anyone like using a float rod the entire time. That's pretty crazy. What's a good setup for 26 Hundo? I don't know. What are you uh what are you fishing for? One thing that you really want fishing planet to add in the game. Saltwater fishing, bro. Gotta get that saltwater fishing. I don't know. I feel like if they added fly fishing, like we would end up still fishing for the same fish, you know? Um I think another thing people would like is a trophy lodge. I think that would really reinvigorate the whole game. Because then you'd want to go back out to the, all of the locations. You know, every location you've ever fished at, you'd want to go back there and catch larger fish to put in your lodge, you know? So, I'm not a huge fan of aquariums. And judging by the size of some of the fish in this game, I feel like it would be, that would be a big aquarium. <laughs> for the fish in the Amazon and stuff like that. But hey, it's whatever. What about you, CJ? What would you want? How are you, Nick Axe? Asks. Asks with an S. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm well. How are you, Nick? Keep it up, BZ. My eyes is on you. Lobe the video. You lobe the video. Hey, guys, I know, uh, I know my usual thing is that I wait till I catch a unique and then I go, all right, I caught the unique. Now think about giving me a like, hit that like button, pew, 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 pew. But there really aren't too many uniques at Emerald Lake. Um, the Sauger, I guess, which I never even knew is uh, one of them. So, uh, so yeah, if you could just hit it, hit it now, <laughs> I would appreciate it. You know, helps helps my uh, uh, state of mind, I guess. You can catch one. I'm. A, I'll take. I'll take that as I'm just looking very uh, sweaty and hot, and hot because it's a very hot hot day today. <laughs> hey Zeus, but thank you. My goodness. What do I get if I get a membership? You know, not a whole lot. It shows that you're a member. Um, it's only two bucks. A month and it shows that you're a member you get to use all the fun uh, BZ hub emotes um, someday you know someday when we have uh, you know finally when we have like a bazillion subscribers uh, we're gonna have to turn the chat on to uh, members only so uh, you know you could just cut cut to the uh, cut to the front of that line you know if that were ever to happen Here's all the uh, all the fun BZ Hub emotes here, but uh, other than that, there's not a whole lot. One of the first times starting to get into it, I caught a two pounder and two half pounders. Well, that's cool. Catching a fish is better than uh, not catching a fish. You know, doesn't matter what size they are. Head out. Good, good seeing you and happy. Caught another stream. Hey, I'm glad that you are here as well. Thanks for being here, man. Uh, with fly rods. Oh, like the hunter? Like the hunter. Yeah. Really need money, so I don't know, but I only got 3,000 for a rod setup. Well, I don't know what to tell you, man. I don't, uh, I don't know where you're fishing. Buy the best rod setup for the fish you're going for. go a little bit beyond it what was that you have to go now late time to be awake Vito says but right on keep it up we'll, we'll definitely keep it up person where I tell them the 162 <laughs> I don't I don't know man do whatever you want to do except for bad things don't do bad things what is this Spoiler alert! Spoiler alert! Gosh dang, Jesus! 
Well, thank you. Appreciate it. We're already $10 away. We're $10 into our fundraiser. Woo! Killing it. Just got a 122 pound unique tame and right on, Jonathan. I'm not sure if that beats me or not. I might have to look. If so, that'd be awesome. Good job. Bobby Worst, hey. What's the best lure for bass in the Everglades? You know, I was always a big fan of the frog. It's always fun to watch them come up and grab the frog on top water. Um, I thought anyway. So maybe give that a shot. But otherwise, buzz baits, bass jigs, spinner baits, all great ones. Um, you can throw on different sorts of uh, soft plastics on the ends of them. Uh, craws, newts, um, that sort of thing. And then uh, it'll get them even happier. Walkers work well uh, for the, the butterfly peacock bass especially. Get to work, Shane. Yeah, that's right. Get to work. I really want them to bring back earning bait coins from catching uniques and maybe add another level species so maybe a legendary version of a fish which is larger than a noonie. <gasps> Whoa, yeah, so that we can, that way, uh, well, I guess they, they really just need to put out unique uh, alligator gar and, uh, and sturgeon, eh? Got some more stuff at level 15. Right on, right on. Let's toss that out. So we're still waiting for that, uh, that small minnow rod to catch something. So far, I've been doing pretty well on the, uh, on the old nan nano, the old narrow spoon. Like a trophy kit. Yeah, exactly, man. Our feeder rod's worth it. Well, I mean, early on, I mean, this is a feeder rod. You know, you don't have access to bottom rods early on. So, uh, so yeah, your feeder rod is basically, uh, your early bottom rod. Now you can see me again. Hey, but now my room is going to get like 10 degrees hotter. <laughs> How did two pound smallmouth buffalo lone star? Right on. Nice. Those are kind of fun. It's fun to catch different fish in this game. I think uh, a lot of people in real life, you know, you buy the bass rod or whatever and some lures and stuff and you start catching bass and you kind of forget that there's a ton of other fish out there and if you change up your tactics, you can catch some other fish, you know? And I feel like it, uh, it improves when you can actually see the fish. You know, when you're on the edge of the water and you can see the bluegill in there, you know, then maybe you go, oh, I'll throw in something to catch bluegill. And then then you see a grass carp over somewhere and you're like, oh, my God, I got to catch that grass carp. It's like four feet long. So then you start trying to catch a grass carp. A trophy yellow perch. Whoa, that's crazy, bro. Look at this tank. Absolute massive. That's awesome. Well, top notch. We got a trophy yellow perch. Trophy gainer two. That's right. Give me the trophies. And we got two bait coins to uh, forward time more. I'm playing now. What is the best carp setup you're playing now? I don't... Click on carp rods. Click on the furthest arrow. It'll show you the best carp rod in the game. That's That's half of the best setup. Then, then find a reel that works with it and line. If we have any questions, will you respond on videos? I try to, yeah. Uh, YouTube doesn't always notify me when people uh, comment, but it, it hits most of them, I like to say. When are we gonna hit the Everglades? I, I don't know, dude. Why do people keep asking me that? <laughs> Whenever I get a 14 pound rod and reel. Golly! Just got the unlimited license at Mudwater. Ooh. Well, cool. <laughs> it's more than the Everglades because I usually make more at Emerald. If you're making more money at uh, Emerald than the Everglades, you're doing something horribly wrong. <laughs> because a uh, 10 pound bass gives you over a thousand dollars per fish so uh and that's only one fish versus a walleye um that gives you 500 max for a five pound walleye here at emerald so you uh you need to change up whatever you're doing oh we got one we got one they had a larger, more rare version of fish, then you'd get more joy of catching it as the unis there isn't really much joy out of catching them unless it's something hard to catch. 
Maybe. Yeah. I, I don't know. Yeah, I'll see Blake. Sorry, I haven't looked yet. I've been uh, I've been horrible at uh, remembering. I'll look at it once this fish is is gone. Recently, got my spinning rod broke, and I don't have a backup. I'm low 27, 4800, and I don't know what to buy with that. Still have a reel. Okay. Um, so your rod broke. Why did it break to begin with? Because we want to figure that out before we get a new rod, and then it breaks as well. That wouldn't be good, right? Um, otherwise, I mean, you know how to do max drag, correct? You've watched our max drag video. So then you, uh, whatever your reel is, you'll want to, uh, find a good rod to, ma to match with it. You know? So it looks like we have the Inspirecast 3000 on here. Blake the Gamer Snake. And if you had watched our beginner series video, you would have saw that. So, you know, don't mean to be that girl from uh, Game of Thrones shouting shame, but shame. Shame. Sh now it just sounds like I'm saying Shane. All right, let's throw this back out there. Trying to catch walleye at Emerald Lake, I keep catching perch, pike, and pickerel. Are they just getting tired of it? Uh, like I said, I think you're fishing on the wrong day. Uh, and that goes for every map. If you're catching fish that are not the fish that you're usually supposed to catch at a location, it, it it's most likely either you're using the wrong lures or uh, you're fishing the wrong day. You can fish the exact same location on two different days and uh, you'll catch two different types of fish. Oh, dang it. Couldn't pull back any further. <laughs> Indo Gamer, hey, how's it going? You can email me if we have questions. No, you can't. You can just chat in the general section of our Discord and I'll answer questions on there too. Uno Moon. Hi. Hello. Adam Clark is late. Ah, eh, you're not late. This was a surprise stream. There was no schedule. Can't be late to a surprise. Deets. Deets, deets, deets. You'll follow me on Twitch tomorrow? Hey, no big deal, man, because we don't even do anything on Twitch. There we go. We're hooked up. Got him. Almost level 30, what a grind, but well worth it. Hey, right on, man. Right on, right on. Got a two pound bass at your lake. Cool, mammoth. You post a picture in the Discord? I like to see the pics. I like to see the pics. We had seafood boil with crab legs. Uh, you really want to know what I had for dinner? I had a big lunch, so I honestly wasn't even that hungry for dinner. I ate a peanut butter and jelly sandwich eating super super rich today luxury is the name of the game when it comes to peanut butter and jelly sandwiches the lure i was using it was too heavy oh okay well yeah then i would just uh try to do a max drag setup with the reel that you have oh look at that we just got this guy in and now we have this other one <gasps> and we oh my god we were just 0.6 shy of filling up our keep net too, so we're gonna be able to keep both of these. Sweet. What's the best spot on St. Croix for Northern Pike? So if you look back, if you just uh, go on, um, if you just go on our main channel page and type in St. Croix, there is like an 80% chance. Don't I? I don't think I figured it out on the beginner series videos. The original, the OG beginner series videos. But if you watch any of the later videos, there's like an 80% chance that we fish at the uh, at the pike spot. There is one spot in St. Croix that is buku, buku dollars for pike. Um, and uh, I would just do a little scan. Do a little scan of my uh, fishing at St. Croix videos and you'll find it. Noise. That's another day, boys. That's another day. Brian Fox, right on, right on, man. Appreciate it. Look at us spending all these bait coins like freaking Mr. Monopoly. Give me that moolah. I got that 2579. 
I'm out of my mind. So, uh, sorry if I'm annoying you about the reel. I just want to know because I like the way how that it looks. You like the way that it looks? That's like the least important thing. <laughs> you can't even see it half the time. It's not even visible. But I dig it. As a person who has, uh, who holds, uh, you know, aesthetic up very high in my career, um, I, I appreciate it though. I appreciate the attention to detail. 200 pounds of walleye and got over 20k. Whoa. My goodness. Hawk a fish on the lip. I don't know. I don't know what that means. Can I fish with you at Emerald? Absolutely. That's why we're on a friends game. Send me a friend request. You come, you come play. What's your opinion on the Amazonian maze? Do you think it's a better place to grind at than Marone River? Um, you know, I haven't quite, um, fully understood Amazonian maze yet. I haven't spent a lot of time fishing there, to be honest. Um, but one of these days, man, maybe I'll figure it out. <laughs> and then who knows? Who knows? Should you save up for a kayak? You're level 15. I don't think a kayak is necessary. I don't think anyway. It's a fun thing to have to get around, but if you really wanted a kayak, one of the coolest kayaks in the game, um, and really only costs you like six in real life dollars. I know that sounds ridiculous. I mean, you can certainly not do that. You can go around and do it for free, run around to all the cauldrons on the uh, Halloween missions and get bait for it. But seriously, for like six dollars, you can get a bait pack for Halloween and then run around and catch all the uh, all the big uh, ogre gar and vampire gar and uh, what is the other one? Yeti gar? Something like that. And uh, and then catch the frankenfish. And if you catch the frankenfish in San Joaquin, you get the frankenfish kayak. Uh, it's the coolest kayak in the game for sure. It has the frankenfish head on the front and everything. So, I don't know. Give it a thought. Whenever, Viking Panda says. Yeah, whenever. What level are you? We're level 15 right now, I think. Didn't we just turn level 15? Oh, hook. Oh, hook. How do you hook them on the lip? You just you just do. You just hook them. How are you, Wyatt A? I'm doing quite well, Wyatt. How are you? InspireCast 3000. It was indeed the InspireCast 3000. Yeah, when we showed it off. What is your user? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I'll give you a tip. It's the same user as my other account, except I put a V in front of it. So now it's the blank. It's kind of my password, though, so if you can't guess it, then you can't come play with me. Or if you don't pay attention when I open up my uh, inventory. Oh god, it's real low. It's real low. Needed to reel this guy in a little bit so that way I didn't lose him. That didn't get that in, yeah boy. Oh no, we lost the other one. Dang it. Gosh darn. It's okay. We were so close. So close. I've been destroying it ever and I now I'm brook repairing. You're brook repairing? Love your videos. I've been following your beginner series and I'm waiting on level 16 to 20. Well, right on. I am waiting on that too. Oh my god, we literally had a wall I come up for in the last four feet. That's hilarious. And that's what you get for not paying attention. Do a science fair just like the surge in Marone versus Amazonian because a lot of people are wondering whether they should grind at Marone to get level 75 or the maze. The maze. I'm not even sure what I would grind at the Amazonian maze. What are uh, what are people grinding right now? 
What do people what do people grind? What level do you think I should get a boat? Uh 54 when you unlock Blue Crab Island. <laughs> Was that the uh, answer you thought you'd, you'd hear? You always take a loaf or PB and J sandwich and fish in real life. You know, it's funny when my wife and I travel places, you know, and uh, and go plan to do hiking and stuff like that, or if we're just going fishing or something, uh, any sort of trip, uh, we go to the grocery store, we buy a loaf of bread, peanut butter and jelly, and we will literally eat peanut butter and jelly for days. Um, I mean, you think about how many peanut butter and jelly sandwiches you can make with one loaf of bread and peanut butter and uh, jelly. So, I mean, we if we're out on a, a week-long vacation, like we can almost get by like every lunch uh, with a PB and J throughout the week. Uh, it's pretty. It's, yeah, it's not it's not glamorous, but it's a certain way to, uh, way to go about it. What is your favorite fish to catch in real life? Ooh. It's a, it's a tie between carp and catfish. I like them both. What size line do you use for these rods? Oh, I think I'm using six pound line right now. It's not uh, it's not max drag, but it, it works. This guy just pulled us out a little bit there. Hello, how's it going, Trix? Quick question, is going to Everglades at level 21 too early? I don't think so. As long as you have a 14 pound rod and a good keep net, I think you should be good. I think you should be good. Nintendo Gamer Pro. Oh! Goodness gracious. Just discovered your channel. is brand new to Fit Beginner Series. Total new to you fishing in general. Your videos are a great help. Hey, right on. Benji? I honestly think that Fishing Planet is a great way for people to learn how to, uh, how to fish. It's not that hard, man. Rod, reel, put some line on there, get a hook. Throw some bait on or, uh, or use a lure. Before you know it, you're fishing, man. Catching fish. Uh, I'm not sure if this is a walleye or not, man. Goodness gracious, what's going on out there? Come here, Pickerel. Trophy chain, Pickerel. Pick up the rod, he nail. Come on, he nail. Pick it up. Jeez Louise. Just standing here doing nothing. Holy... How are you doing, Elijah? Ask. I'm doing quite well. How are you doing, Elijah? Hey, hey, 103 viewers. You think we're going to hit 100 likes? I don't think it's possible. I don't think it's possible. Goodness gracious. What's the best tip on the Everglades? It's bass. You throw a the lure and you catch a the bass. Catch a the bass. The, uh, the peacock bass actually pay a little bit better than largemouth bass. So if you, uh, catch, but they're smaller, you know, seven pound, eight pound, uh, well, there's no trophy walleye right on, right on. Um, yeah, seven, eight pound, uh, peacock bass is about as big as they get versus the, you know, the, the, the largemouth bass will go to 12. So get more money per pound with the peacock, but you get more money per fish with the bass, so it's, it is whatever. Pretty much grinding on a whole bunch of fish, whereas Marone is just a big catfish, yeah. Yeah. Piraiba. Yeah, the Piraiba. What level are you? Everyone's wondering what level I am. I'm level 15. Golly. Golly. When did you start the stream? Eh, around 7.30. Kinda. Around there. You know what? You know what? I, I think it's time for uh, halftime. Easy Hub Halftime Show, not sponsored by any of these brands. Now, take it away, Dwarven Pirate. Arr, aren't you tired of not being a part of the ship of BC Hubbards? Well, are you? Support Bo and the BZ Hub by becoming a member today for only two measly doubloons. And if you're feeling extra generous, become a Hub Lord for only 10 pieces of booty a month. But if you've got treasure bursting from your pockets, become a Hub Master for only 20 doubloons a month. 
and that's a great price. And if you ask Bo, he'll say I'm cutting this a little short. What? Wait, is that a height joke? <laughs> Curse you, Bo! A fast ye matey! Agar! And now, a glimpse back at yesteryear. Ah, a fair maiden fishing on a sunny day. But what's this? A small fish? This could only be the work of... Black Whisker? <laughs> yes, it is I, Black Whisker. And now you shall only catch small fish. Oh, no! But what's this from up above? It's Captain Unicorn Man. Grr, Captain, you've decided to join us. Too bad you're no match for my small fishes of steel. <laughs> Curse you, Captain Unicorn! Thank you, Captain Unicorn! You are my hero! Check out all of Bo's Fishing Planet Monster Fish videos by watching the Halloween Extravaganza playlist only found on the BZ Hub. Now, back to your scheduled broadcast. Okay, I have to be honest, I'm slightly upset because that's the same halftime show that I've been playing for the past couple streams and I actually made a new one and I thought I put it on that button but there was no way of me there was no way for me to know until like the uh, glimpse from the past came up Ugh. but then once it already happened then I was like well I can't play another I can't play the other one because then it'll be the whole thing over again Ugh, I guess we'll just have to wait till Monday see the uh, see the other one I made I'll have to remember have to remember that that's not the uh, new one. <laughs> oh what do we see how often do you post post all the time man almost every day hello BZ hello Rylan Wyatt not grinding your bass boat to go bass fishing in this game all right good deal you're gonna like what lures do you recommend for large mouth bath large mouth bass in the game uh i gotta say for everyone uh frog buzz bait spinner bait um bass jig walker all those are good well thank you iq What's your thoughts on Call of All the Angler compared to Fishing Planet? I have big dreams for the Angler. I have a feeling they'll do really well. They're gonna make a quality fishing game. It might take them a year or two to uh, to get their game together, but uh, I think it's gonna be a great game. Really do. I remember when they kind of interviewed me about a potential fishing game. Um, oh, like a year ago or something like that. It was cut now I don't think it was that far I think it was like winter fall last year and uh, and they were basically like what what are my thoughts about EW making a fishing game and I was just like I think EW would make a great fishing game I really don't have much else to say <laughs> and, and that's still how I feel I still th I feel like it's gonna be a great game Do you think Rocky Lake is a good place to grind no no it's a good place to catch lots of fish. If you're tired of not catching a lot of fish, that's a good one to go. Zach did a great job in a Black Whisker roleplay. I thought so. It's like I tell everyone else, you know, uh, I, I like to hold myself up on a pedestal a little bit when it comes to casting for uh, different uh, videos that I do. And when I was trying to find, you know, an attractive blonde woman you know, with the bright red lipstick and all that sort of stuff. First person that came to mind was my blonde brother. I was like, ah, no one better. This bushy beard and everything. <laughs> it's, it's perfect. Oh, golly. What bait are you using? We're using small minnows. While I love small minnows. At what level are you ending the stream at? I, I don't know. Didn't really have a plan. I just I just started a live stream. Anything good? Sure. We've been catching all sorts of trophy walleye. Sure, Shane. In add, add away. 
favorite muffin flavor. Oh, now you're making my thinker work. Ah, uh, I'm not sure. Muffin flavor, man. Down to our last minnow. Oh, golly. It's kind of a tie between chocolate chip and like banana nut or something like that. I do like banana flavored muffins. Kind of reminds me of banana bread and I love banana bread. So, yeah. Love your videos. Well, thank you. Cool guy five. I have a setup for spotted bass and it's really good. Well, right on, man. I'm glad that it's really good. Keep thinking your bell is mine. Oh, I understand that. I get that. Got your first whitetail diamond. Nice. Hey, Yubbo. How's it going, Lazarus? Oh, thought I heard a bell. I always thought Lazarus was a cool name. I don't know if it's because it kind of sounds like lizard or what, but I just always thought the Lazarus sounded like a, a hero in a medieval night movie or something sir lazarus of the triangle table what lures do you recommend for largemouth bass oh my god how many times have i a answered this question i've answered this question like six times already this live stream golly where did this come from Usually the question is, where should I be fishing at X level? <laughs> 23, 27. <laughs> guys, guys, guys. It's just like real life. Toss a bass jig, toss a frog, toss a buzz bait, spinner bait, walker. Uh, throw on some soft plastics on the ends of them. Try it out. Bass go for all sorts of stuff, dude. There's people who have caught bass on on GoPros with hooks and action figures with hooks. Bass are freaking crazy. They're just temperamental. They're temperamental sometimes. Sometimes they won't go for anything and other times they go for everything. The best muffin is blueberry. Well, see, my mother used to make me blueberry muffins a lot when, uh, when I was growing up. Zachary and I. Um, so, I mean, blueberry muffins are rather nostalgic, but at the same time, I don't think they're my favorite muffin. What the account name? The account name is the uh, password. You gotta find it. You gotta either wait for me to open up my inventory or you gotta figure it out yourself. Uh, I gave a hint earlier that it was the same username as my other account. I just put a the in the front. T-H-E. The. Any news about Call of the Wild, the angler? Not really. Don't really have any news. Grayson with the sub. Thank you. Ooh, I threw in a little twitch there, evidently. Phase Fuse, how's it going? What's up, BZ? What do you think about Fishing Point adding a deep sea map? Bruh, deep sea map would be freaking crazy, man. Be like the sea but deeper you know um, yeah I think it'd be sweet John Thomas how's it going what bait are you using for the other rod my god that's another question I've heard a bazillion times this stream small minnows you yeah, guys you gotta watch the BZ hub beginner series huh you're asking all these questions that I tell you in the series why did you wait till now to figure it out? They had those videos available to you forever. What is your fish brain user, Bo Bear? It's 
scored three points off of a diamond. Oh, goodness gracious, Jonathan. That was close, though. Do you like Hunter Call of the Wild or Fishing Planet more? Do you like cake or do you like icing better? There we go. Hook him. Hook him, bam. Mason Murray, hello. How are you? Just got back from catfishing and I've got my PB blue catfish. 39 pounds. <gasps> Did you post a picture in the Discord? Huh? Did you post a picture? Better post a picture. That is... That is the price of telling me about fish that you catch. You have to then show me a picture. Uh, I love seeing the pics. I like to see the big fish. Two Western Capricale. I missed. I missed one. It went up and I missed it. If you use leeches at night, you can catch walleye so quick and easy. I promise you. Uh, dude, you don't unlock leeches till like way later on, I believe. On console is gonna kill me. Gladly I'll have to watch play it to hold me over. Hey, glad to hear it. Glad to hear it. What is this? I was going for when I made that name. <laughs> Love. Hey, good deal. <laughs> How much money do you have? We uh, currently have 16,000 right now. I'm not sure how much money I want before uh, I go to the Everglades, but uh, as much as I can get, I guess. We're just gonna keep on fishing. Just gonna keep on fishing. Give me all damn fish. Which I think you unlock, when do you unlock Everglades? Do we already unlock it? I can't remember. Can't even remember. Uh, let's see. Everglades. Level 18. Okay, so I definitely won't. I'll probably end up staying at Everglades until level 18. Maybe. I don't know. It depends on... Depends on, um... Yeah, it depends on how long it ends up taking. If it gets to a point where it's just an absolute horrible grind, I might end up going into Heron. How you doing? Hope the fam's okay, Benny boy. They're they're doing just great. Imagine they add saltwater maps, but you got to be level eighty. Ooh, that'd be something, eh? That'd be something. What is the Discord links in the description? I got Discord links down there. What do you think about Russian Fishing 4? I think Russian Fishing 4 is hands down the best fishing simulator out there. It is the closest to real life fishing that a game has gotten. I, I think anyway. Didn't show your user, also I went fishing today. Well, right on. Did you have any luck, Blake? Hey, Bo, how, how's it going, Scrap? An 18-inch brown trout in a super-pressured trout stream. Dang, David. Well done. That's awesome. Gotta show me a pic now. <laughs> I'm gonna make that a video. Hey, if you ever tell me about a fish you catch in real life, you gotta show me a picture. It's it's part of the process. Can't. It's just such a tease. It's such a tease to tell me that you catch fish, but then you never show me it, you know? Ah, ah, Mr. Charlie just became, just, just started following on, uh, on Fish Brain. Where's Charlie? Where are you, Charlie? There's level 16, and we're making our way. Making our way to Everglades. Doesn't feel like we're, uh, grinding too much. I'm just catching walleye. Catching walleye and hanging out. Two rares and one diamond. Nice, cool guy. Yeah. Do I get a PS4 and play the Hunter Call of the Wild? I, I don't know. If you want to. I don't know. What is the Discord ID? I, there's a link in the description. I don't know what to tell you. Go down to the description. Look for Discord. And click the link. 
not there's nothing else to it. What's my favorite line color in Fishing Planet? I don't really care. Whatever allows me to catch the fish. I use a lot of fluorocarbon though. Are they still updating this game? I'm on the Fisherman version. Oh, you need to stop playing the Fisherman version and get over to Fishing Planet. Dude, we just got another fish on the other one. See if we can manage this right now. Diamond potential golden eye just landed. Whoa. Like James Bond over there. But yeah, they, I mean, they literally just put out a new map for this game um, last month or something like that. So they're up. They're still updating it. What should I reel and when should I pull when I have a fish on? Uh, so when your meters are maxed out like they were just then, uh, they don't if you try reeling it's just gonna pull line out faster I I end up reeling more than I should because I'm reading the chat and stuff and if I'm reeling in constantly with the rod tip up then it decreases the chances of me losing it um, because I'm not paying attention I'm reading people's chats so uh, but if if you hear the clicking from your reel that's the fish taking out line and you should stop reeling in at that point Juggle, 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 juggle. Can you get this guy in? So, yep, I think so. Trophy and a new PB! Right on! Grab it, he nail. Come on now. Good night. I thought we were going to lose him. What did you miss? What did you miss? About a bazillion walleye. Baseball field and I didn't think they were fish, so I made a PVC pipe and caught one. What? You caught a fish in a PVC pipe? Am I understanding what you're saying correctly? What do you suggest for tarpon on Blue Crab Island? Uh, poppers? Large minnows? Uh, buzz baits, different ways to catch tarpon. They're uh, they're fun fish. They they just go for different stuff on different days. There is a particular day that has a peak in the in the morning for like one hour, and there's a peak in the evening for one hour. And if you're fishing on that day, you need to rush on over to the uh, island at the very end of the uh, ocean area, and just start throwing top water lures is they will destroy them. That's uh, that's like one of my favorite things to do in the game. We already have fish on? We do, my god. Here I am, chatting away. Chatty Cathy over here. Meanwhile, I got a fish on. What is your fish name, fish brain name? Bo. Bo Bear. I'll show you, I'll show you here. Here I am. Here, we'll make the make it bigger for you to see. There. Bo Bear. B O B E H R. Find me. You can find me on Fish Brain or other retailers. <laughs> I can't remember what the commercials used to say. Love the videos you have really helped me with the game right on. Jets Adventure says hi as well. Hi. How's it going? How is your day today? My day was great. How was your day? I uh I worked. I uh planned out my uh my uh alligator guard trip coming in a month. Uh, a little bit more anyway. Paid for our hotel days. <laughs> that sort of thing. Um, try to figure out all the financials of the whole situation. Um, yeah. And then I went to Target. Oh, that's fun. Uh, and then I played Fishing Planet. So that's cool. 
Just posted a pic of my catfish in real life trophies in the Discord. Hey, right on. I'm trying to figure out if it's still playing a song right now. It's very quiet. What are good spots to catch largemouth bass? Oh, golly. My. F Whoa. It's literally playing a song called Ice Cracks. It's not even a song. This is like a freaking sound effects. All it's doing is playing the sound of ice cracking. What in the freaking world? How did we get on that? Blowing my mind right now. Trolled you. Who trolled you? Lazarus. I think they should add a South Dakota map and fishing plan. Add walleye, smallmouth, bass, beluga, red ear, carp, pike, and channel cats level eight. Would be interesting. Am I ever gonna play real VR fishing again? I don't know, man. I, I really enjoyed the VR games, but they were a freaking pain to set up everything for the videos. I have to use a special recording software. I've got to, like, honestly, that's the biggest thing. Then I have to use the goggles. I got to plug them into a charger. I've got to uh, um, get the green screen, get the camera set up. I don't know. It's just a hassle. It's just a lot of work. What do you suggest for tarpon on blue? I already told you all. Ain't telling you twice, bro. Go check out the blue crab videos if you want to see. I talked about it for like two minutes. Easy check Instagram DM. I have my proof of my monster striper. Okay, right on. I'll have to look in a, in a while. How much small videos would last 12 in-game days at Emerald? If you would know how much small minnows would last 12 in-game days at Emerald. I, it depends on the size of your keep net. I don't know how many fish you're catching. Carlos, how's it going, Carlos? Ooh, about halfway to 17 right now. What are good spots to fish for uh, largemouth bass? Everglades at the two docks. At three docks. There's three different docks at the Everglades that are great for bass. Cast towards the lily pads. Did not find you on fish brain. Well, what's the deal? Well, thank you, Jake. Why are you making a live video when it's a Friday? I felt like it, Carlos. Sometimes when you feel like doing stuff, you just gotta go with it. So long as no one's gonna get hurt. Alright? I don't wanna see anyone beating up someone and then their principal is is uh, sending me a message in YouTube saying, hey, we have uh, a Carlos Amaya here. He said that uh, you told him to, uh, if you felt like beating someone up, to beat them up. Yeah, I will not have your back. <laughs> I will immediately say, uh, I told Carlos to only do that uh, if no one was going to get hurt. So, you know. Oh, I missed something here. Love your tutorials, but I still can't make money, sadly. What's the deal, FaZe? Come on! What are good maps to find largemouth that? What? Everglades and, uh, Naharan. Quanchkin Blue Crab. Hot and Tyler is one of the best deep divers out there and won't snag. Well, that's cool, David. Where is the best spot for Northern on Ed... Oh, I don't know. Ethan Gamer with a sub. Thank you. Appreciate it. Best spot for Northern on Emerald. Yeah, I really don't know. Maybe towards there? These guys? I, I caught a lot of northern out here, but I catch... Most of the northern I catch are just while I'm fishing for walleye. They'll go up and grab a small minnow. <clears throat> I 
Just caught a 121 pound unique tarpon right on. 12 pound bass in Oklahoma last year. Sure you did. Sure you did. In Oklahoma too. If you're gonna tell a fake story, you might as well make it good. You don't see me saying, hey, back when I was in Canada the other day, I caught the largest arapaima you wouldn't believe. You know, you immediately know that I'm telling a lie. Turkey, how's it going? What's F2P? F2P stands for free to play. That's why all of our series two videos start with F2P because I'm not using premium or any other things that cost in real life money. Narrow spoon, quarter ounce, one on green. It will catch you a lot of walleye. Hey, I don't know if you realize this, Blake, but I'm actually already catching a lot of walleye with the purple one. So, uh, I don't feel like I need to, but thank you. Hey, I don't know if you know this, Blake, but if you breathe out your nose, you'll keep on living. Try it. Next time you start breathing out your mouth, try breathing out your nose. You'll you'll continue to live. That's a that's a BZ Hub tip right there. I didn't have a notification though. Wow, what's the deal? Catfish bait. Can I join your lobby? Absolutely. If you're uh, if you're a friend of mine on here, you can join in. Best pike spot on Emerald, yeah. All right, I, I have no idea. I don't fish for pike on Emerald. Is your name in Fishing Planet? It is in Fishing Planet. Yeah, I have a name in Fishing Planet. You can find it. Level 11 and I'm stuck at Lone Star. Well, what's the deal, FaZe? Follow along with our beginner series and get out of Lone Star already. Wow, what a load of horse crap. We were practically hooked up with that guy. Ridiculous. What's a good bait for taming? I don't know what a good bait is. Is it? They have a they have a minnow there, a, fr a freshwater minnow or something like that, specific to the Mongolia map, and uh, large minnows also worked as well. Well, we are catching them on anyway. Catch a twelve pound bass. It's on fish brain. Um. Just because you put on fish brain that it weighed 12 pounds doesn't mean that it actually would. I see lots of people, you know, they get their action figures out, put the fish next to it and say, hey, here's me holding my biggest fish ever. Um, you know, 100 pounds. And then I go, that's a G.I. Joe. That's not you. And, and then they disappear, you know, they don't answer me back. You saw my new video. Well, right on, Carlos. How can I add you? Well, first you gotta guess what my uh, my username is, and then you send me a friend request. I'll tell you this: the best time to uh, to guess when my what my username is is when I open up my inventory. It says what it is in the top right. Love the videos. You helped me through the game so much. Right on, Alan. Glad to hear it. Is this part of the beginner series too? I guess in a way. I mean, it's the same account. I'm just fishing here because I, I knew I needed to catch a bunch of walleye. How's it going, buddy? Hey, buddy, old pal, old friend. How's it going? It's going quite well. How's it going with you? What is my favorite catfish? You know, my favorite catfish is one I really haven't caught a lot of. Uh, I honestly don't think I've caught one above 10 pounds. Um, that's a flathead catfish. The flathead catfish is one of the most apex predators of the Midwest. And uh, I think it's great. It's a great fish. IQ. But it does not work, but I still love the tutorials. Huh, interesting. Uh, I would make sure you're using the same similar equipment on the same day that I'm fishing because weather can play a huge effect on the days that you're fishing on between corn and sweet corn for carp um no not really 
Uh, I, knew, I do know they like sweet corn, but I mean, we use boiled corn. We'll just boil, like, feed corn for cows and, and other farm animals, uh, hogs and stuff like that. We'll boil the, sweet, the feed corn and uh, mix that with other stuff for carp as well. So, I'm sure they'll go after normal corn as well. I'm going to skip a bunch of days here. I'm not actually, we should probably look and see when the next good day is. The next good day is in two days. It's going to cost us a thousand dollars to make twenty six hundred dollars. Actually, it's right here. What? That's crazy. Well, good deal. We're back in it, boys. Should at least get to level 17 today. I'm thinking anyway. Sixty-nine foot pet goldfish, dude. That's that's sick. It's a big one. And then, it was, and then I hooked an electric gill, and it killed a world record arapaima. And now I hold the world record holder, the world record for uh, largest arapaima killed by an electric eel that you hooked. That's a sick record. I suppose so. Caught some blue cats today, that's awesome. On squid. You caught them on squid? That's crazy. Worked though, it sounded like anyway. You caught them. You can't see me. Ooh, where am I? Am I hiding behind hiding behind my microphone? Where am I? Why can't why can't I I don't know why you can't see me? Your secret bait. Are you in a friends only game? I am in a friends only game. Another walleye, bro. New friends only room. Right there. There's the proof. The proof is in the pudding. Something like that. I can't remember what exactly. It is. There's someone. I see you out there. Fish slayer or something like that. You think that pickerel are the worst fish in the game? Early on, they're not too bad. You know, I like catching them with the bass. Um, but, at, at, you know, after that, then, yeah, they're not great. What was your first fish in level 18? I don't know. So, they look like that old camo pattern they used to put on shirts and stuff. <laughs> Best way to make a lot of money, level 12 or 13. The best way to make money at level 12 or 13 is to watch the, uh, the third episode of Series 2, BZ Hub Beginner Series. Saves It saves me from having to save words that I've already said in a video. Which will allow me to live longer, so thank you. Any tips on how to make more money? Oh my god, do I? I literally put out a video yesterday about how to do that. I would recommend checking it out. Um, no, that's all I got then. Yeah, I would watch that. A lot easier than me trying to tell you right now. Hello, your vids are cool. Hey, thanks, Master. Master? Making me sound like a, like a slave. Massa. Ooh, that was a good pop. All right, sounds good, Happy. See you later. Twenty-pound flathead at Hugo in Oklahoma. Right on on cut shad. That's sweet. Just want you to know that I follow your beginner series to try to level up as fast as possible so I can play with you at the Slang River. Anyways, you're my idol. You idol? What? I'm like an idol. It's like what you find at like uh, like temples and stuff. You know, they always talk about Indiana Jones. Always talked about finding the golden idol. Man, I'm as cool as a golden statue to you. That's sweet. Appreciate it. You could say with me being American, 
that I'm an American Idol of sorts. I, I could probably go ahead and, uh, and say that. I am an American Idol. I might put that on my, uh, my LinkedIn account. She's got to wake up early for a flight to Jamaica for vacation. That's awesome, Gavin. Sounds really cool. Are you reading these? You better bleed it. But bleed it. Don't bleed it. You better believe it, though. I read all of them. Try to, anyway. You're so hyped for the ang angler? I am, too. <laughs> Definitely. How much is the Bass Boat Explorer pack? I don't know. Uh, crazily enough, I don't keep a, uh, a spreadsheet of how much all the DLCs cost. Wonder how many times you've said EESS since you've started Fishing Planet. Another time right now. Uh, I don't know. A lot, I would assume. You know? <laughs> Almost 32k, I know. When we started the stream, I was at uh, 31.92 or something like that. I'm not sure where we're at right now. I'm sure we're a little bit higher. Sassy mustache. That's true. It's very true. <laughs> you rock. Keep doing what you do, man. Thank you. Appreciate it, Robert. Favorite fish to catch in the game? Uh, I think tarpon. Someone asked me that earlier in the stream. That's what I said, so I'll stick with it. They're just a fun fish to catch. Especially on top water. <laughs> Finally, more likes than live viewers. It's a rare thing, but yeah, we get there sometimes. Do you know the other night we hit 300 likes? I don't know who wasn't there. That was insane, though. My god. 300 likes and one live stream. Where are good spots to catch pike? Um, there's one special spot on St. Croix. Go there. Turkey's kind of annoying me, so we might go to a private match. local would go to practice diving at the lake. Apparently one of them dived down and saw a turtle big enough to bite a kayak in half. My goodness gracious. You know that's one of those uh, stories that uh, everyone has. Um, I, I think at every lake I've been to, they've had some sort of story about people going down and diving. And actually, uh, Jeremy Wade talked about it in River Monsters too. It's just one of those myths that have just gone down in every single location. Avery, thank you so much. Thank you for the content. Well, thank you, Avery. Really appreciate it. As everyone can see, we have a small fundraiser to uh, to get some, some drone footage for our upcoming fishing uh, videos and whatnot. Every little bit helps. So thank you very much, Avery. Appreciate it. What's my favorite type of lure? The one that catches the fish, bro. Um, I don't know if I have a favorite type of lure. I use a lot of bass jigs for uh, bass, though. Like bass jigs, good, good, just good overall lure. I think you missed your comment. I, I guess so, Adam. What'd you say, Marcus? Thank you for the sub. Thank you, Jennifer. Appreciate it. Is it with the carp setup? You were there. Yeah, it was. Yeah, it was, it was the carp setup. Bring back hunting sim too. Yeah, and bring back diarrhea while we're at it. I love that stuff. What kind of line do you use for largemouth? I don't know. Whatever gives me max drag around 14 pounds. Another yellow perch. 
Saweet. What's up, Zeke says. Yeah, what's up? Not a whole lot. I'm playing a fishing game. What are you up to? Good live stream. Captain Unicorn must have been. I think so. We were feeling we were feeling Captain Unicorn vibes that night. I I believe anyway. Captain Unicorn was with us all. I close my windows so no one peeks in on me while I'm fishing for walleye. Oh. We got a fish on here. Didn't know that Fishing Planet added a mouse lure? Well, then you missed all of our Selang River streams, didn't you? Oh, yeah? We'll ride on, motocross. Yeah, hook us up, bro. That way, during our uh, half times, we can, uh, we can put in sponsored by Bass Pro. They would love that. Bass Pro would love being in the halftime show. Everyone wants to be part of the BZ Hub halftime show. Monster, uh, Corda, they're all there. Level 17, everybody. Let go. Everyone likes level 17. We got red maggots. Huh? I mean, that's practically why people want to become level 17 is for the maggots. Yeah, sweet. Good deal. We're at 19 pounds right now. Still need 7 pounds of walleye to uh, get that next one. You like Red Dead Redemption 2? It is a fun game. 150 likes? We're one away from what I see. One away from it. You're catching walleye and fishermen fishing planet? Oh, Jennifer. Do yourself a favor and don't play the fisherman fishing planet. Go play, go play the regular fishing planet. You don't want to waste a lot of time in Fisherman when it's it's an abandoned game. The highest it goes is Blue Crab Island. You won't be able to do any of the Amazon maps or anything like that. Um, Selang River, all that cool stuff. <laughs> How do I get rid of COVID? EESS, absolutely. How much money do you have in the game? Uh, right now, I think we just have... I don't know. I'll have to check after we get this fish in here. Somewhere around 17, maybe? At level 32. I, I don't know. Off the, off the little uh, platform in the middle of the lake is where we caught most of our catfish. So we have $1,965 worth of fish in our keep net right now, and we have just shy of 23000 in the bank. So. so just about $25,000. Should play it right now. Good deal. Kid about Hunting Sim 2. No joke. Love the vids. Following your second beginner series, and it's helping loads. Hey, right on, Colton. Glad to hear it grass carp in our lake that are untouched so they get up to almost six feet one day we saw a carp head just floating in the middle of the water so that turtle might actually exist <gasps> oh my goodness gracious i think so i think you've got a world record turtle on your hands i think you should go find him go get him the ducks are so fun, just wish they'd land faster. Dude, I was in the exact same shoes, Lazarus. That's like one of the first things I told EW when we were playing the beta. I was like, I love these ducks, but they need to land a lot faster. <laughs> Big up, bro from UK, Brad S says. Well, right on, Brad S. Love having some people from the UK. You know, in, uh, what is it, October? I think it's October. October, we're supposed to be in Leicestershire? I think we're supposed to be in Leicestershire. Let's go call the wild. That's right, Russell. The fisherman is a scam. 
Yeah, kind of was, wasn't it? I don't think it started off like being a scam, but it just ended up a scam anyway. Even if they didn't mean it to be, <laughs> you know? How's it going, Cod God? To watch, catch this live, watch you play the Hunter Call of the Wild live. Been keeping tune in since. Good work, man. Dakota, hey, right on, man. Glad to hear it. You use three odd hooks and catch three pound or more walleyes each time. Whoa. You know, when I first came here, I don't even know if three odd hooks were unlocked. So, uh, but I bet if I came here after this point, I could probably certainly get, uh, you know, certainly get three odd hooks now. Of course, I won't be coming back here because the goal is to go to Everglade. Does he now have a girlfriend? A great question. Uh, I don't really know. He, uh, he doesn't talk about it. In fact, I don't even think if, like, there are girls in his, like, alien. I think, like, they just, they're just kind of, like, one gender. They're, like, everything. Just, I don't, it's a weird alien thing, you know, they have all the bits and pieces. Ever, all of them do so it's not he, he said something about you know not really looking for a girlfriend just looking for the right the right alien essentially so I, I I leave it at that I don't ask anything else it sounds freaky sounds freaky to me whatever they get up to I don't want to know when I get to level 18 am I going there <laughs> just might who knows should you quit playing the fisherman and go to fishing planet? Absolutely. You know that's one of the one of the videos that I've never put out is I actually recorded a video uh, saying don't play f the fisherman fishing planet, and uh, and I never did put that video out. So maybe I'll have to go back and re-record the whole thing. As a as a thirteen year old, well, good deal, Faze. You go get them, man. I'm going to have to go take a shower here soon, too. I need to finish my my workout on my phone. My phone tells me my workout I need to do for the day. That way I can get super, super cut and, and trim like a Greek god, you know? You're going to be looking at me, and I'm going to be like, Ooh, these muscles, man. Look at them. And you're gonna be like, whoa, wow, look at Bo's muscles, so muscles, it's like, it's like Hercules. Uh, no, but we'll, we'll certainly see. <laughs> Alberto, that's a great name for an albino turtle. 150, I, I know, yeah, happy camper. You're from Ireland, well, right on, Shane, that's cool. From Ireland, that's where half of me family's from. The other half are a bunch of Germans. Very serious Germans. We only eat sauerkraut and sausages and stuff. Very serious. How about you, Cod? Uh, I'm, I'm doing great. I'm playing a fishing game right now. I'm having fun. Looking forward to content playing, uh, uh, playing fishing line, but I think they should make it easier for beginners to get money. I think they should make it easier for beginners to, uh, to not destroy their game and, uh, and, uh, and have like no point of returning basically. There's so many people that I think stop playing fishing planet simply because they broke a rod or did something of the sort and uh and there was like no point of return so they just stopped playing so yeah i don't know will be better than fishing planet or how do you think they'll compare i i do think that it'll be better than fishing planet eventually i think it'll take three or four years maybe even five years uh but i do think eventually it will be probably the best fishing game on the market Hey, there's a fish. I hope they add saltwater mapped in Georgia. That's where I live. Oh, right on. You know what? If they ask me, and they never do, uh, I'll definitely say that they should add a saltwater map to Georgia. 
Useful with fireworks or just an extra thing? The fireworks are actually for uh, different holiday events. I believe Christmas and uh, 4th of July. Um, they help you catch historic fish. Other than that, there's really nothing useful about them. And where's Woodworking Beagle? He, no, he's just a busy guy. Probably woodworking or playing with his beagle or something. I don't know. Have I caught the unique chain pickerel? No. The beast! How's it going? Are you late to the live stream? No, you've been here for like the past half hour. Why would you be late? And it was an unscheduled live stream. You can't be late to something that wasn't scheduled. <laughs> Where are you from? I'm from Antarctica. No, I'm uh, from Kansas. Right on. Tell you what, everybody, that is going to fill up our keep net all up there. Um, and it's going to give us another 2,500. I am debating with myself right now whether I want to leave or uh, do something else. I tell you what, I think I'm going to leave. We'll get some moolah. That's going to help us out. You're from Ohio, right on. Hey, hey, how's it going, Joe? Great turtle tails, absolutely, Landon. Take care. See, uh, oh yeah, we need to play that, Brad. I've thought about it. I put it in my wish list a while back. Um, what's the difference between the Fisherman Fishing Planet and Just Fishing Planet? Uh, the Fisherman was like a paid version of Fishing Planet, where everything was a little easier. Um, but it was completely abandoned, so it's not. It's no longer supported. It doesn't get updates doesn't get any new maps nothing so if you want to play all the new maps and uh, play a game that actually continuously gets updates you need to play fishing planet go to emerald lake to get walleye heck yeah well said you're in the maze right now nice gamers any tips no no tips for you <laughs> no tips gamers hello how's it going uh lake of the woods a lake of the woods would be pretty cool cold what's up tegan how's it going uh, no middle georgia what was your first fish oh golly probably a, a sunfish of some sort of bluegill or something oh you're back well right on youtube what's up getting pc so i can join you on the stream sounds that sounds awesome forest have a good night are you late for the stream can't be late to something that wasn't planned well everybody we uh did some damage to our rod but we are one level away from Everglades. And I think I might go to uh, Naharan. I don't know. That or I might end up going back to the Everglades. I kind of want to see what we got here. What we got available at level uh, 17. There's a jig winner. 3 to 11. Uh. Ah. Call me crazy, but I think we might end up waiting to level 18 to buy a uh, bass rod. Let's see, what do we got for casting rods? We got level 18. They have an Argo, 5'3". God, that's a really short rod, too. There's a 11.5 Jester. Hmm, I don't know about that. So it's either between this Gary Scott Argo or the, uh, the Jig Wig Jig Winner six foot ten here. Uh, no, seven foot ten. Wait, eight foot ten. This one. No, that's that's the that's twenty. Guess it okay. Well, this one we'd be able to cast further, whereas the other one. Yeah, there's no way I'm buying a five foot three rod. That's ridiculous. So I guess we're going to end up waiting till level 18 to buy the jig winner seven foot ten. That's it. I have decided. And check. Right on. Well, everyone, glad you uh, you came. This has been fun. A uh, good little Friday unplanned stream. Uh, and ended up streaming pretty much the same times as we usually do, right around 7.30 to 9.30, so that's cool. What's the best time, Emerald Lake? 
Uh, you're just gonna have to back up and, and look at the time I was doing because there's no way for me to really show you, I guess. Well, let's see here. Can I look at it now? Emerald Lake. This time right here. Go to like 1 p.m. on day three, this one right here, where it's just one big hump in the middle. That's what we were doing anyway. So anyway, everybody, glad you could be here. This has been great. Uh, take care. We'll see you next time. And as always, remember everyone. Planet One Family. Game on.